So by now I'm sure you've heard the term mirrorless cameras. They've been on the market for a while now and you may have been thinking to yourself what the difference between a mirrorless camera is versus any other camera. Now as you probably guessed, the difference between a mirrorless camera and say a DSLR is that they don't have a mirror. So as a little bit of background, DSLRs actually project the light two ways when it enters the lens. When it goes in the lens, there is a mirror that both bounces light up into the viewfinder and also lets light go through to the image sensor to capture the image. So that way you can look through the viewfinder and actually see what you're looking at and capture it at the exact same time. Now mirrorless cameras don't actually have a mirror and instead of looking through a viewfinder, you're gonna have the image displayed on the back LCD screen. They might have a viewfinder above that pops out, but you're not actually seeing what the camera's seeing, so there's gonna be a little bit of discrepancy there. The main advantage of a mirrorless camera is that they're way more compact than a DSLR, and they pretty much can capture similar image quality depending on the one you get. Unless you're a professional, and if you are, you really don't need me telling you what camera to buy, then a mirrorless camera is definitely going to suit your needs probably better than a DSLR, especially since it's a lot more compact, easy to carry around. Most people don't want to have to carry around a big clunky DSLR. As a matter of fact, most of the really high-end mirrorless cameras are probably better than the lowest end DSLRs. So don't assume that just because you buy a big DSLR camera that it's going to be the best one you can buy. A lot of times it's just as important to get a good lens and you can actually buy interchangeable lenses for mirrorless cameras as well. So then why might you get a DSLR over a mirrorless camera? While mirrorless cameras can pretty much capture the same image quality, they're not the most ideal in certain situations, such as if you're trying to get a lot of rapid shots back to back, a DSLR, especially a mid-range to high-end one, is probably going to perform better in that aspect. So now that you know both sides, you're probably thinking, well, I still don't know which one to buy. So I'm going to help you out here. If you want to take the best pictures with the best lenses that you can keep for a long time, you probably want to get a DSLR, and at that, a high-end DSLR, which is going to cost you. If you want to actually be able to have a more convenient camera that can take great pictures still, I would get a mirrorless camera. If you don't need to get a DSLR, you probably shouldn't get one. A mirrorless camera is going to be a lot easier to carry around and will definitely suit your needs better. I mean, look at it this way. If you buy a giant DSLR camera and you don't carry it around all the time because you don't want to have to lug it around, you're not going to get any pictures. But if you buy a small mirrorless camera, even if it doesn't take as good image quality, you're going to still be taking pictures, which is better than none if you're leaving the other one at home. So let me know what you think in the comments. You can tell other people too. If you have a DSLR or mirrorless, maybe even a point and shoot, which do you prefer, DSLR or mirrorless? Which do you think is more suitable to your needs and why? I'm really interested to know and I'm sure a lot of people are also. And also don't forget to like the video and subscribe because I like to make new videos all the time. I got social media sites, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Google+, the links are all in the description. So check me out on there as well. So see you next time.